Hey, what's up, guys? The Beast and Jay here, and I have today with me the October Loot Crate. This month's theme, I believe, is fear, um, which makes a lot of sense in in uh, correlation with Halloween. Now, something I noticed kind of interesting: this box is thinner than the previous ones I've received. I have the other one I received right here. Let's show you for comparison. So it's thinner, yes but it's also heavier. So uh, yeah, I'm excited to see what's in this bad boy. So why don't we uh, take our handy dandy Batman knife and uh, dig right into this sucker. Ah. All right, here we go. Um, okay. <laughs> okay, okay. I don't know what this is. It's a box. It says hamburger on it. I have a bloody box that says hamburger on it. This is evidently... Oh, okay. On the back it says Dead Rising 3. That's something that's up my alley. As many of you watching this right know, right now probably know, I'm, I'm a huge gamer. So, oh, this is pretty cool actually. Okay, so we, we have a weapon crafted from Dead Rising. Um... I don't know how to put it together, but it's cool. Hang on, let me, let me, there we go, all right. Nope, 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 I broke it. It's broken. No, it's not broken, of course it's not broken. It just requires a little bit of assembly here. Um, this is cool. I actually not played Dead Rising 3 yet. I have played Dead Rising 1 and 2 though, and uh, I'm a fan, I plan on playing Dead Rising 3. I actually plan on playing Dead Rising 3 during my Extra Life Marathon. Um, but this is a cool little figure. I can't get this freaking wheel on. It's it's driving. All right, yeah, it looks like it's not on. I'm never gonna get it on. But this is it right here. Let me get him really close. It's like a constructed chainsaw uh, sledgehammer, a la Dead Rising Three. So that's a cool little thing. I don't know what I'll do with it, but it's cool. I like it. Um. Oh, whoa, look at that. What is this, a stylus or a ghostwriting marker of some kind? So that's that's what it does. It looks like it could be maybe a invisible ink writer or maybe a stylus. I'm not really sure just yet. Um, hopefully somewhere in here it, it says what it is. So this little chainsaw part is the, uh, the cover for that. That's cool. I like that. We're off to a good start. I'm a fan of that. Aside from me not knowing how to open boxes without breaking things. I'm a fan of that. Moving on. Uh, what I was laughing at is this hilarious skull shirt that you might not be able to see from far away, but it is made up of kittens. Yes, kittens, folks. It's a skull made of kittens. Um, this is one of my favorite things I've seen and received from Loot Crate in the last three months. I actually really, really adore this shirt. It's very cool. I'm excited about that. Um, what do we have here next? Okay, it looks like I've been given a membership card to Loot Crate. I'm going to cover up the looter number because I don't know if I need that for anything important, but here's my Loot Crate membership. They sent me this today, so I don't really know what this does. Um, but I'll be sure to uh, update you guys when I find out what the heck that's for. This is hilarious. <laughs> okay, so I have a survival guide to Sharknado. Any of you uh, fans of the Sharknado movie, that terrific, terrible, terrible uh, movie that was really probably the highlight of Tara Reed's career? Um, sorry, Tara Reed. She's never going to watch this. She'll never watch this. Who am I? She doesn't care. So, yeah, we have a survival guide to how to stay alive during a Sharknado. It's actually pretty, uh, there's, there's like a, a decent amount of stuff in this book. So that's funny, and I like it. It's made by the sci-fi people at the Sci-Fi Network. It says so right on the back, sci-fi.com. Um, that's cool. We're off to a good start, you guys. I'm really digging this, this box here. I have 3D glasses. I'm assuming something in the box. Is going to be meant to be used with these 3D glasses. So why don't I throw those on if I can get them on my big giant noggin. And we're going to keep going. 
back into the 70s. Um, I'm just going to keep them on and wait for something to be 3D. I can't read this, though. I'm not sure what this is. I don't know what this is from. Looks like maybe something from The Walking Dead or some kind of horror genre thing I'm not familiar with. I like it. The animation's really cute. So that's 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 a plus. Um, I wish I knew what more of this stuff was. These, these things are popping off my head. I'm done with that. I want to open it to find out, but I want to give it away. Um, if you've watched these unboxing videos before, you're probably familiar that I'm giving all this stuff away. So if you guys know what this is, let me know. And if you want it, let me know. I'm actually going to start giving away this stuff sooner than the marathon. All you have to do is go to my Extra Life page. I'm going to link it right down here. And um, if you go there and you donate, I'll see your name. Leave your name and your email address. Tell me which prize you're interested in. And I'll shoot you guys an email and let you know if you won. Um, I haven't been receiving anybody, anybody saying they want some of this stuff yet. So... You know, it's all up for grabs, you guys. So if, if you're the first one to donate, go and donate a dollar, donate five dollars. None of this money is for me. It's 100% going to the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia, and it's helping out the little kids who are sick there. So, um, yeah, none of this is for me. So just go and donate a dollar, five dollars, whatever, and let me know which prize you want, and you guys will you guys will be in the running to get it, and I'll, I'll send you an email right away. Um, you have a good shot at getting whatever you wanted, though, because no one's been claiming anything so far. And like I said, I'm going to give, be giving away other stuff during the marathon as well. Um, what do we have here? Fast and free voice communication for gamers. Get the most out of Smite with Curse voice. I don't know what this is either, you guys. I don't really know what this is. There's a Jack the Reaper skin. It must be for a game. I got, I'm going to cover up the code right here. So I got that to give away. That's cool. Hopefully somebody enjoys this game and uh, will enjoy that prize. Now right here, I, it looks like I've got... Uh, stickers for slashes and bites oh no, these are temporary tattoos temporary tattoos horror theme for slashes and bites we got a little zombie bite here what do we got we got scratch we got a zombie mouth zombie bite vampire bite and a werewolf bite finally that's down here you could probably guess which ones are which uh so that's cool I, this is one of my favorite boxes i've opened so far honestly oh here we go it, it looks like this loot crate fear magazine is in 3d so if you want this Loot Crate Fear magazine, as well as these handy dandy glasses, and you want to enjoy a little bit of 3D reading, you can. It's actually very cool. I don't like these glasses won't stay on my freaking giant face, but it looks cool. This is what It's all out of focus without the glasses on, but it's cool. On the back, there's this gruesome woman who's popping out right out of my face. This is actually pretty cool. I like this a lot. And uh, the entire magazine is actually all in 3D. This giant chainsaw to me is popping out. I wish I could... Let me let me emulate that for you. It's pretty good. Pretty good 3D effects, right? So yeah, that entire magazine is in 3D. That's what the glasses are for. We find out. And then finally, our last item... Oh, well, I didn't mention... I got a little piece of candy here. It's called Lemon Toxic Waste Sour Candy. Just a little guy. And then I got my Loot Crate pen, as I always do. I don't know what's on this. Looks like looks like some, just some zombies all over this bad boy. Um, and then my final item right here is an issue of the Walking Dead Loot Crate Edition. Um, there's a signature, but I believe that's just a print. I don't think that's an actual signature. I will find out. I'll get to the bottom of that. Because if it is a real signature of someone's, I want you guys to know so you guys can win that. Because that's pretty cool. But I think it's just a print. Uh, so what do we have? Well, yeah, 132, The Walking Dead. It's called Happiness. Looks like it's a special Loot Crate edition of this. I don't think you can get this uh, outside of Loot Crate. So, that's everything I have for you guys for the October Fear Loot Crate. This was one of my favorite ones out of the three I got. I don't have any more coming. Will I subscribe again? I don't know. I might. I probably won't. I'm not, I'm not really that thrilled out of the, a lot of the stuff I received from this, but you know what? It's all for charity, so that's what's really important. I'm going to link my Extra Life page down at the bottom and in the description as I do on all of these Loot Crate videos. So you guys can go check that out if you want to win any of this stuff. And remember, you guys, we're less than a week away from the Extra Life 24-hour Game-a-thon extravaganza. 
Uh, it's October 25th, 8 a.m. to October 26th at 8 a.m. We're so close. So make sure you tune in to win all that stuff. If you guys like this video, make sure you also hit that like button. So that way I know what you guys want to see and what you want to keep coming back for. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I would really appreciate it. It would help me out so much if you did. Um, once again, I'm the Beast NJ, and thank you all so much for watching.